I just got back from plant shopping at Oakdale Greenhouse and the only thing I can say is prepare yourself. I did not realize the plants that they were going to have there. It blew me away. So many plants I'd never even seen before. I mean, and they are packed, packed full. So I would say if you are in the Charlotte market, definitely this weekend plan for a trip to Oakdale Greenhouse because you won't be disappointed, that's for sure. And they have a lot of selection. They have really rare plants. They have uncommon ones, they have common ones, and a whole range across the board as far as pricing. So I did have a nice haul, which I will share with you at the end of the video after the plant shopping. It was insane. So I'm really, really glad that I got to go today. And I had a budget of $50. <laughs> so we'll see how I did with that. <laughs> with that budget today. I I went in um, not really uh, expecting what they had. So if you're new, welcome. My name's Ashley and clearly I'm a crazy plant lady. So if that brings a smile to your face and you like planty stuff, definitely subscribe so episodes will show up in your newsfeed. And we also have a fabulous community on Instagram where I share all sorts of tips and tricks and planty stuff. Now don't forget there is a way for you to actually purchase some of these amazing plants that I find while I am plant shopping. I've included a link in my description to one of my favorite local plant shops in the Charlotte area that I have partnered with called Cactus Club. They are amazing at mailing plants and they have terrific plants on their website. And if you use the link in my description, a small portion does go towards supporting my channel. So thank you so, so much to all of you for your support. So I'm excited to share this with you and I can't wait to see what you guys think about my haul at the end. Wow, I just be prepared guys. Just be prepared from the plants that I see off the bat. First up is a Stromanthe Charlie Variegated. I've never seen this type of Stromanthe before. They have it here and it's 44. Now a lot of these plants, they have different sizes and different prices depending on the size. So for instance, they have a Gloriosum here. These are 82 and I do see some other Gloriosum as well, but I can't believe they have the Gloriosum here, amazing. They have some Alocasia Stingray, 21. They have the Calathea White Fusions, 24. Over here, they have Philodendron Florida Green, 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 and they have the Schistema Glottis. This one's different, Motliana, 39. I love those leaves. Syngonium Winlandii, I see a lot of Syngonium Winlandii in here. Oh, they have some little babies. They have Philodendron Warshawesii and Tortum in there. Oh, some little goldie eyes. So this nursery has a lot of uncommon and rare plants. I mean, I see some here that I've never even seen before. So those are going to be priced more expensive. And then they have the plants that are more common and those will be less expensive. Now, a lot of plants that used to be, even just last year, so expensive. I'm seeing um, the prices being greatly reduced this year on them. So it's neat to see kind of the range of prices on everything. So here we have the Philodendron BTA, and again, prices vary depending on where you live in the country or even in the world as to what's available. So they have some cute little BTAs here, 39. Homolonema Pink Splash. This one I've never seen before. Homolonema Pink Splash, 79. Look at these leaves. They have pink stems, and these are big. Wow, that is incredible. They have some Piper Crocatums here, 59. Oh, oh my gosh, look at these up here. I can't believe I didn't just name them right away. These are Anthurium. It's a hybrid of Radicans and Luxurians. They are 149 and they are big, big mamas. Look, and then some of them look like they might even be blooming. Oh, amazing. Let's keep going. Oh, this is a beautiful olive tree, 259. 
is just awesome. I'm so sad. I read somewhere there's an olive shortage and I'm one of those people that, you know, my snack is like, go grab the olives out of the fridge. So, uh, maybe an olive tree <laughs> will help with that. Um, what is this one? Just, they have some cute little terrarium plants here. You know, some little, little babies, some air plants. Okay, they have this one, it's called an Alocasia chientlii and Toro Velvet 79. I've never seen that before. And let's give it a feel. Okay, there's a little bit of a fuzz, but not super fuzzy, but a little bit of texture there. Pariso Verde 74. And some of these are really big. I mean, look at, oh my gosh, the Spanish moss. It's really pretty. Look at this new leaf coming out the top there. If you can see, it's like coming right here. That's gonna be a big one. <gasps> they have Thai constellations here, guys. 108, amazing. Oh, they have Yopii. These were like thousands of dollars and I'm actually seeing them now on the market. 64. Oh, what am I gonna do today? I'm gonna have to be very, very selective. It's gonna be so hard to decide what I bring home. Cause this is a wish list plant. Yopii. Look, it's really famous. It has the tiny little lobes and then like the big, the big leaf that comes down there. Oh my gosh, they have Philodendron Gigantium Blizzard. This is an awesome Philodendron. These are 119. This is the only place in Charlotte I've ever seen these. Alocasia Platinums, 49.95. Schistomoglottis Wallachii, 21. Very nice. We have some Pink Ladies, they are 39. And again, there are other sizes on the other side. Cream Splash, 79. Ooh, Mayo Eye, 29. Anthurium Bonplandii, 32. Saracestis Mirabellis, 69. Such pretty leaves. Philodendre Jose Bono. What did I say, Philodendre? <laughs> oh my goodness. I've been taking my lion's mane trying to help with my memory and my brain, but I don't know if it's helping me. Epipremnum Panatum Albo, 59. Monstera Pinati Partita. Anthera Genmanii. Again, I apologize for the fan. Shiveriana Moonshine, 29. Geogenanthus Popeget, 29. Looks like they have some yellow fusion Calatheas, but I'll go back to that. Homolonema. Purple Sword, Anthurium Big Red, 29. These are so big and beautiful. Have some Alocasia Quilted, or Sinuata Miraface, 21. Homolonema Lindii Sunshine Gem, 29. It's this really pretty, vibrant green color. Anthurium Arrow. Some fun alocasia. Brancifolia, so Serpent's Tail. That's the one that looks like this, which looks so much like a philodendron to me, but it's not, it's an alocasia. Anthurium Hookeri. This one looks like it's variegated. Let me just go over here. Does that look variegated to you guys? Like a variegated bird's nest? Yeah, it's definitely got some variegation on there. Wow. 49. Look at those roots. Oh, wow. Uh, what am I going to do? So many plants that I would love. Pterodactyl Anthurium. I have one of these and it is thriving. And I like the ones that, because it's a hybrid of Clarinervium, one of our all-time favorites, and Fingers, Anthurium Fingers, they can look very different depending on the plants. And I really like the ones that favor the Clarinervium and have that like heart shaped with the veining. I love it. 
Look at this. They have some Magnificums here. 69. The, if this is a real true and Magnificum, it's that those leaves are going to be big. Wow, this one looks like it has some a spot on there. Gloriosum. Can you imagine a variegated Gloriosum? How cool that would be. Um, white Fusion, Philodendron White Knight. Guys, I'm a struggling. I'm going to want all these plants. Philodendron Birkins 54. Or, sorry, Birkins Pink. Somebody commented that Birkins Pink is a reverted something. Look. This one has a little... Gosh, there's a lot of little sport sport stuffs. There's a lot of little sporty stuffs happening here. This one looks like a Melanochrysum, but there's so many... Yes, this one is a Melanochrysum. 69. There's a lot of plants out that look like Melanochrysum. Uh, Anthurium Red Luxuriance. Goodness me, this leaf. Uh, 119. Some beautiful pink princesses. 59. Some more painted ladies. 49. And then these are white knights. Oh, we have some different ones. Okay. Philodendron white knight here. 32. White Princess 49. Look how pretty that white leaf is. Oh my goodness. Be still my heart. Look at this big BTA. Oh, I would love a humongous BTA. There's 72 though. Oh. The OPI and the BTA are like. I'm going to pull it out and see how big it is. Look at that. Oh my gosh, she's so pretty. Hmm. Ah. <laughs> All right. I already have one of these. Um, but that one's so pretty. But maybe I should just like do better job growing the one I have, you know? Just like that can be goals. I don't know what to do. Anyways, we're still just getting started. <laughs> All right, so this is a beautiful uh, Pariso Verde, 74. And I, oh, Philodendron pin, Pinatum, 54. Uh, Calathea Mosaica, or Calathea Networks down here, 39. I think I saw a variegated alocasia. Yeah, it snuck in here. Gagiana variegated, 99. So, all right. Next stop, so many amazing plants. Oh, Aglionemas. All right, here we have Aglionema Snow White. Green Bull, oh, Snow White was 14. Green Bull is 24. Cutlass over here, 24. Valentine, 26. Valentine's one of my favorite. It has those almost pure red pink leaves with a little bit of green. Aglionema. Red Siam 19. This one is so neat. This Aglionema stars. And like the leaves look like they have little stars on them. And then it has pink down the center. Tell me that's not a cutie. I've never seen that one before either. I love it. Philodendron New Red over there, 24. Tigris Aglionema, 24. All right, we have some Marantas. $9.95 for this lemon lime. Okay, they have some variegated ones here. $19. Yeah, look at that. Really, really pretty. Red prayer plants, nine. Green Marantas, nine. Global Green Pothos, 19. Marble Queen Pothos, 16. Golden Pothos, 16. Pothos Jade, they do such a great job of labeling. Hawaiian Pothos, 16. Pearls and Jade, 16. Neon, 19. And then Snow Queen. They have some massive Diffenbachias over here. And some Silver Satin, Skindapsis. This one's Silver Lady, 69. Okay, Philodendron Pink Princess, 58. White Princess, 49. Melanonii Gold, 19. Zebra Plant over there, 19. 
Some new red back there, 24. So many cool philodendrons, oh my goodness. Red sun, 14. Black cardinal, just, they got all the philodendrons today. 11.95 moonlight, Prince of Orange, 19. Macaulay Finale, 19. Philodendron Ruby, 39. Such a beauty, another new red, 39 here. Some more Prince of Orange. They have Singo they have a uh, Wenlandii, Syngonium, or Nepenthes. All of these are Wenlandii. They're so beautiful. I got mine from here and it's doing great. So just don't underwater it. As in, once it's ready, like only let it dry out halfway and then water it or let it dry out but then water it right away. Don't leave it thirsty for a long time. It's not a fan. Let me uh, learn the mistakes <laughs> so you don't have to. Philodendron Revolution 62. That's cool, Philodendron Revolution. Like, look at this from the back. Isn't that interesting? Wow, that's really neat. They have some huge goldie eyes. The big goldie eyes are 70, 79. Jungle King Anthurium 39. These big hanging baskets of Mykins are 29. We have some beautiful Brazil over here, 32. So many gorgeous plants. Whoa, I cannot believe this. This is Philodendron Calkins Gold. I have a small one of these and I think I got it for $20 or $30. And it's so tiny and these are so massive and so beautiful. Oh my goodness, they're like Painted Lady, but um, instead of having pink stems and pink on the backs of the leaves, it's this just beautiful gold color. Look how big they are. That is amazing. Wow. What a find. They really have outdone themselves. Did you hear the, the ceilings making some noises? Um, wow, look at this beautiful philodendron. She's so big. Okay. Rojo Congo 49. They always have a terrific assortment of snake plants here. But first up, there are some ZZs. There's the standard green ZZ, 24. ZZ Raven Black, 32. ZZ Zen Z, the cute little um, like dwarf one, 29. Lucky ZZ, I don't, I'm not sure, 24 over there. ZZ Black Queen, 29. Then there are Laurentii snake plants, 8.95. We have some whale fins back there. The variegated ones are 59. And there's La Rubia snake plants back there, 34. Cylindrica here, Superba, 16. The Cylindricas are 16, and there's a snake, a Bob one, 26. Xylanica, 16. Laurentii, 16. Silver Laurentii, very cool, 19. Moonshine, six inch. Um, yellow stone, I haven't seen that one before, 39, very, very yellow, especially up next to the silvery green sa uh, Sayuri. Xylanica, some more yellow stone, and uh, there's black coral as well. Okay, this is the next section, and let's explore. Gosh, there are so many amazing plants. Look at this cool terrarium setup they have with loads of these pitcher plants. Oh, I love these origami hanging here. And what is this? Oh, they have a Deschidia here. What is this? Deschidia Oentha White Diamond, 79. And there is another Deschidia here. Russifolia, Million Hearts, $7.95 for the little small ones. And then they have lots of string of pearl little ones. They have variegated string of pearls there. And these, I'm so curious how much they are. $5.95. 
I would recommend getting a larger one because the roots are more established when you get the larger size, especially with string of. I, I mean, I can't say I've had the best success with small string of varieties, even the string of hearts, but if you get one that's more like this size, these are 24 for the string of hearts. Um, it just has so much a better chance of success. And the variegated ones are also 24. So many great plants. And then the larger um, variegated string of pearls are 1195. It's a good deal. And then they have string of turtles, so cute. Ooh, what is this? I'm so curious. Oh, they look so fuzzy. They remind me of lamb's, lamb's ear, but they are angel wings, Senecio angel wings, 9.95. Wow, look how pretty that is. Oh gosh, I can imagine with like the right pot and some white rocks. That would look so neat. Some crassula. <gasps> Look, guys, they have some like amazing cacti that you never see anywhere. Okay, they have the spiralis, which is the spiral cactus. They're 99. They're uncommon, especially here in North Carolina. You just don't see them around hardly ever. The only other place that I've seen that carries them is Cactus Club. Then there's some booby cactus. These are fun. I have two of these and they're 99. I also have a spiralis. Look at those. They're like really big, nice size ones too. Snow White, 39. They have all sorts of uh, euphorbia. So cool. Oh, look at these. These are the mistletoe. Mistletoe cactus, 24. Oh, look how beautiful it is. Um, when they're sun stressed, they turn this red color. And I think that's why they're called mistletoe. And look, they, these have little berries forming. That is beautiful. Oh, they have a load of uh, rickrack cactus, $24.95. Oh my goodness. I've never seen these anywhere except uh, one nursery called Big Bloomers. And I got one from there. And it's this Sissus Quadrang, $21.95. It's so easy to take care of, like totally low maintenance and so weird and funky looking. Like you, I'm sure you can just hear the happiness in my voice seeing these plants. They're so cool. They have these, um, it looks like it would be a Ripsalis or a cactus or something uh, type of plant. And then it puts out leaves. Just every once in a while, it has little leaves. I, you know, cystus, I believe, are related to grapevine. So you can kind of see like the grape, you know, heritage there. But these are so big. And they're only, this one's only 21. I, it puts mine to shame, to be honest. But I already have one. I can't go buying another one. But this humongous plant, $21. Oh man, that's awesome. Oh, look at these babies. They're so big and beautiful. These are nice as well. Serious Monstros, $29. They're big too. Wow, look at this one. Oh, she's so pretty. Euphorbia steno clada. I've never seen that before, 129. Look at these orchid cactus or fern cactus. This one is Amazonica Blue Flame, 79. Just gorgeous. Strappy leaves, I think that's what it's called when they're that shape. And then these are the fern leaf cactus, 99. Some of the biggest I've ever seen. We gotta take a look at these Hoya, oh my goodness. Look at these Hoya, $49.95 for the Carii Variegated. And then they have some over here on little poles. They're so cute, they're 40. They're nice sized ones. Oh, this is a unique one, Hoya Sigillatus. I haven't seen this one much. How much is 32? And there's Hoya, this is a Lacunosa Mint. I've never seen the mint one, $24.95. Wow, they have so many interesting Hoya. Hoya Meliflua, $29.95. Amazing. Pachiclata, $19. Here's just this, the regular Lacunosa. It's $19 for the regular Lacunosa. Hoya Croniana Black. And 
1995 on that. This is one of those that I'm so happy to be seeing it more regularly on the market. Ooh, Hoya Chelsea. Oh my gosh, look how cute that little lizard is. Hoya Chelsea. How much is it? 74 for the big Hoya Chelsea. Oh, this is neat. Hoya Breviolata, 19. Hoya Carnosa, oh, that's over there. This is Gracilis, actually. The Gracilis are 34. They're nice sized ones. Then we have Crimson Queen here. Crimson Princess. Macrophylla. Absolutely lovely. Some Ficus Tenekes. Ooh, they have lots of hanging ones up here as well. They even have the Hoya Carrieis. Over here are some smaller Hoyas um, and some different varieties. There's Hoya Australis Lisa Variegated 19, and I believe this one is Shepardii. String Bean, yeah, that's Shepardii. And it is 19. A tiny little Hoya Breviolata, so cute. You know, Hoyas are one of those that I find the small plants do okay compared to other plants when they're small and if they are left to their own devices they like die right away. Hoyas tend to do okay. Hoya croniana black, silver. They have some different cronianas. It's nice to see all the different varieties finally on the market. Maybe some Bertinet over there. Rosita. Australis. All right, walking through they have some gorgeous parlor palms and all sorts of stuff. And I've actually heard that they will rent out their plants as well. If you have an event and you need plants for some reason, they'll hook you up. Ooh, look at this pagoda. Oh, there are so many plants, hooray. Dang, I came on the right day. Silver striped philodendron, 69. Now a lot of these are uncommon, so they will be um, you know, on the more expensive side, and then the more common ones are less expensive. Marble Queen Pothos, so beautiful, $8.95. We have some Cebu Blue over there, $24. Pothos Churchill, $8.95. I'm not sure what that is. Pothos Jade, $8.95. Silver Streak over there, which is the Amplissimum. Let me go over there so I can show you a little bit better. Yeah, there it, there it is. Amplissimum, so gorgeous. Florida Ghost, 29. Oh wow, Philodendron Rio. That's cool. Wow, I don't think I've actually seen a Rio Rio before. It's usually Silver Stripe, Cream Stripe, White Stripe. 34.95 on the Rio. Peacock, 21. Jungle Boogie, 49. Wow, that's be I have a huge Jungle Boogie and it's one of my all time favorites. Not uncommon, but just I'm in love with it. Alocasia Regal Shield, 24. Philodendron Campii Lynette, 74. How awesome is this? I love these leaves. So, so awesome. What are you? What are you? Oh my gosh, look at these Anthurium. Anthurium Queen of Hearts, 124. Oh my heart. Oh my gosh. Oh, they are so beautiful and massive. I mean, look at the size of these leaves. They're chocolate, chocolate brown. Oh my goodness. You guys know anything about this one? I think Cass, one of my friends has some. When I saw her, did her houseplant tour, I saw some. Wow. The plants here today is the best I've ever seen. Staghorn Fern, 9 95 Look at this. Calkins Gold 64. Just beautiful. All right, we have Syngonium Alley, is what I'm calling it, because this is where all the Syngoniums are. They have Plum Illusion, Golden 595, and 
They have some white ones here. Ooh, they have milk confetti, 21. As you can see right there. Not sure what type this is. And then they have Syngonium Batik, 16. Silver Fox, 19. White Butterfly, 9. Neon Illusion. So beautiful. Got some fun Tradescanti. We have Nanook, which is this vibrant, vibrant purple color. Ficus Rubber Tree, 24. Altissima. Burgundy. Lorata. Wow. There are so many great plants here. Ooh, Syngonium Red Arrow, 24 here. Amazing. Calkins Gold. Anthurium Bird's Foot, 34. Look at that. That's so neat. Bird's Foot, 34. I wonder if it's a hybrid of something. That's so cool. <gasps> there are so many plants. Lots of gorgeous ferns. And here's the summer glories that are so popular this year. $39.95 with that just stunning, bright, pinky orange new leaf for philodendron. That's awesome. And then they mature into this lovely dark green color. And then look at these Syngonium towers behind. I think this is the Red Arrow Syngonium. We have some nice alocasias. They have black velvet, alocasia, mellow. Look at the texture on that leaf, amazing. Skindapsis trubii. Wow, that black velvet is just stunning. I apologize for the fan, but they have to keep the fans going. It's so, so important for the plants. Oh my, God. whoa. What are you, my love? Oh my goodness. <gasps> oh my, she's so pretty. Philodendron Splendid, 39. Shut the front door. Wow, look at these Syngonium Albos, 32. <gasps> they have Syngonium Chia Pens for 28. I literally have never seen these anywhere except for Cactus Club one time. Oh, this is one of my favorite Syngonium. The leaves are so cool and they get huge. Big silver sword over here, 64. Smaller silver swords, 29. Okay, out of breath. <laughs> oh my goodness, fuzzy petiole filled engines, 24. This is crazy, crazy. This must be a, this must be a pink princess. Tang. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I can't take all these plants home with me. Shut up. They have skeleton key, Epipremnum skeleton key. These get um, fenestrated and have a really, really unique shape that looks like a key. Like, I'm gonna see if any of them have the shape yet. Oh my goodness. I can't believe they have them here for $30. Wow. Okay. Something flame. Neon. Epipremnum Neon, 14. Cebu Blue, 11. Pothos Emerald, 8. Wow, a huge philodendron micans. Oh my goodness. Oh, uh, my camera's gonna run out of batteries. Um. Begonias, all sorts of Rex begonias, angel wing begonias. Look how beautiful. Oh, wow. Look at that humongous begonia maculata over there. How much is she? How much? 59 for this really big begonia maculata. Incredible. Mona Lisa Lipstick Plant, 29. Monstera Pinati Partita CM, 32 Siam. My pronunciation's not the best. Monstera Minima, um, this isn't a Monstera, it is a Raphidophora Tetrasperma, 24. Monstera Deliciosas, lots of Monstera Deliciosas in all different sizes. 
beautiful. Look at these variegated lipstick plants, 1995. I love the little blooms, they're so delicate. I've never seen this one before. It's Pilea chocolate. And it looks like it's flowering. So pretty. Moon Valley Pilea. The chocolate is $8.95. The Moon Valley is also $8.95. Pilea peperomioides, $14. This one says it's called Costa Rica. Looks like a watermelon, but maybe it's a different, slightly different variety. Looks like Ecuador back there with the really big leaves. Um, Peperomia Hope, one of my all-time favorites, $12. Scandins Green, they have a lot of Peperomia, look at them all. Quito, Rana Verde, Orba, Shumi Red, Ripple, Berbella. I mean, vanilla orchids here, which I believe are actually a cutting off of a huge vanilla plant they have. Look how beautiful this splendid is. <gasps> Amazing. $39 too. Hmm. I just have to point out, look how huge these cock and golds are. Like, they're so big. I've only ever seen the little ones before. That's amazing. And look how cool this um, Anthurium bird's foot is. There's so many great plants here. So many great plants, I love it. I almost completely missed these, but look, they have Epipremnum albo. But look how massive the leaves are on this. Definitely fully mature, looking so beautiful. They have quite a few of those for 59. And then they have the Standliana Alba, Albos here, 64. Tell me that wasn't insane. Like the plants that they had there. Oh my goodness. And I'm actually really proud of myself. I mean, super proud of myself for limiting what I purchased because I could have easily spent $1,000 like that. I mean, that's crazy to think I could spend that much on a house on houseplants at one place in a couple of hours or an hour, but there were so many. I am glad that I went in there with a $50 budget and I had recent, I've recently done an over budget but worth it video. So I was like, I can't do an over budget but worth it video. Although I'm sure you can guess if I stayed in my budget or not. Anyways, so the first plant that I got, I'm sure will actually be a huge surprise for everybody. It is this very beautiful Monstera Deliciosa, and it was $24. And the reason I ended up picking this one out is that I'm doing a care video on Monstera Deliciosa, explaining the entire process from like, and I'm gonna be filming every process, every part of my process, so plant, picking it out at the plant shop, exactly what I look for. Then when I bring it home, cause I have a care routine that I go through now to prevent pests and all that, I'm gonna be filming it. I'm about to actually do that process in the bathtub and using my like pest management techniques and then repotting it because this baby is so root bound. Look at these roots, they're amazing. Oh my God. You know it's root bound when I can't get the thing off. Look at that. She is so, she's so healthy too, like super, super healthy. Look at all these plants in here. So I had my $50 budget. I was like, okay, you know, I'll spend $25 on my Monstera for my care video and $25 on a cool plant. I had no idea the plants they were gonna have in stock. And so I did walk away with one plant. I know I'm actually really proud of myself for only getting one because again, I wanted like 100 plants. So again, it was a really hard decision and I ended up going with the plant I really wanted. Not because it's super trendy, not because I don't have one, not because I just really wanted it. So this is the plant I ended up getting and it's a Philodendron Bietiae. Philodendron Bietiae are such fabulous, fabulous plants. 
and this one is so healthy so beautiful and so big <laughs> compared to the one i have and i splurged a little bit it was 72 dollars so i definitely went over budget i spent around like a hundred just over a hundred dollars on the two plants when i do my monstera treatment i'm going to also be doing the same exact treatment to the BATAs. so if you're curious what my treatment is that i do with all my plants when i bring them home um, just watch that video when it comes out. It's gonna be like Monstera Care video. I don't know how to explain that I'm like, you're coming along with me during the whole process from choosing it to treating it to repotting it. So I'm not exactly sure what it's gonna be called, but it's gonna be my Houseplant Care 101 series. So I know I always say this, but let me know what you would have picked out if you would have been plant shopping today. I'm actually so curious what you guys would have picked especially considering all of the plants they had there. And don't forget, I have partnered with Cactus Club, their local here in Charlotte, North Carolina, um, to provide plants for everyone, and they have some fabulous plants on their website. So I've included a link in my description, and I do get a very small um, portion that uh, supports my channel. So thank you so much if you end up getting a plant from them. They're 10 out of 10 on mailing, too. They're the best. Um, definitely subscribe for future plant videos and follow on Instagram because our community on there is wonderful as well. All right, everyone. I hope you have a great rest of the day. Hopefully, um, I'll be seeing you soon. Bye.